Suit up, partner. Almost time for the semifinals. Stay sharp, Sly. Iceland and Belgium will be at each other's throats up there, but you're still outnumbered. Relax, Mom. This is going to be great. All righty, guys. Welcome back here. We are in his last three honor among thieves, and we are taking on these planes in a dogfight and we are gonna have to smoke every single one of them okay x is to boost r1 is to fire oh my god look at them I, I feel like running into them isn't the best strat either i'm losing a lot of health double kill got him Ooh. Yoink. That gave me full... Oh, that gave me full... Like, bullets, but it didn't give me full... Health. Do I have any health at all? Probably not. There's no health pickups. Makes sense. Hey, otherwise that would be, like, cheating. What do you want to do? Pick up half a plane on the ground. Ow! I think I just got to keep shooting. My guns don't overload. Like in uh, Sly 2, so that's good. Oh my god, get him. Yeah. Oh damn, I missed it. What if I do this? In here. Ooh, what's in here? Nothing. Okay. Oh my god. Well, they'll get them all anyway. They ran into each other. That works. Got him. Oh. Got it, Bentley, thank you. I don't feel like I'm flying just so slowly, man. What? What's that noise? It sounds like it's it's choking. Oh my god, get them. Oh. Ah! Come on. It sucks with that crosshair, hey. I mean, people in real life have to do it, so I don't see why I would <laughs> do it. Why I would, I would get a crosshair. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oi. I've only killed eight planes. Eight. I feel like I've destroyed so many more than that. Holy crap, this is going to be a very long dog fight. Ah! Bro! Let's start again! Oh my god. <laughs> Tim Cooper's just one plane. Uh oh. Yeah, it's probably very stupid of me to do that at the start of the the, uh, the first time. Ah. I was lucky. It says they're gunning for each other, but I don't see them shooting for each other. I see bullets. Thank God. Boom. Got him. Let's get some more ammo. Oh, that could have been terrible. Alright, we're already up to five. It is a good start. Come on. Yes. Oh my god, look at them all. There's so many of them here. We're <laughs> very similar to the colour of Team Iceland, too. Yeah. 
Yes. What the heck? Ah! This is, yeah, something that's definitely different from uh, all the other Sly games. <laughs> is There's a lot of flying in this level. I don't remember there being this much flying. I'm out of bullets. Damn. Through the smog. Oh, there's one there. Did he just hit the bridge? Oh, man. Yeah, I found I don't really want to be behind them because um, they seem to shoot at me a lot more because I've got people shooting backwards. All right, I'm halfway. What did I just say? I don't want to be behind them. Oh my god, they're everywhere. Oh, that was lucky. Damn it! Oh, I can loop. Hell yeah! Holy crap! Come on, yep. You next. You next. Thanks, man. I'm out of bullets. <sighs> ah, got it. Come on. It's daytime too. That's actually something else. Um, you don't do many levels or episodes that are at daytime, but this part is a daytime. I mean, it's easier to see, which is great. Oh god. Come on. Come on. Get him. Yes. 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 Five more to go. Uh-oh. Out of bullets. Quickly, under the bridge. Where's the next bridge? Over there. Mm. Uh, what do you reckon? How many of each are left? Uh, none, apparently. Okay, there's... There's a Belgium. Oh, and there's some more. Die, Iceland. More like Diceland. Yes! Nailed it! Okay, now where are the rest? They're obviously following me around in circles. Almost there. Only three <gasps> more left. I didn't know I could do a loop too! Raccoon yeah, raccoon. Yeah, I'm the one who's killing everyone, but okay. Hello. There you are. One of each. Come on, where are you at? Die! Oh, thank God for that. Well, I don't remember that taking nowhere near as long as it did. Holy crap. Thanks to Sly's flying, we're officially in the Aces Finals. Our opponents, Team Mugshot and Team Black Baron. The rules in the finals are a bit different than normal. Whoever takes out the defending champ gets the title. Hear that, boys? It's all about taking down the Baron. Our only real competition will be Mugshot himself. We need to remove him from the competition. Here's the plan. I'll challenge him to a fist fight out in the town square. Sly, you find and lure Inspector Fox to the same place. When the two meet, the sparks are sure to fly. With some luck, the big guy will get carted off to jail, and we'll have clear skies for the fight.
However, the Baron won't be so easy to deal with. He commands an enormous team of flyers and has been known to bring in a squad of limp gunships when things look grim. The answer to our problem isn't obvious, although it is potent. Behold, Lupus Gigantormus. I'll drug the beast so that the Guru will be able to ride it and take out some of the local guards, who also serve as the Baron's pilots. Obviously, the fewer enemy pilots Sly has to deal with in the finals, the better. Next, I'll hack into the aircraft control tower. If successful, I'll be able to intercept any messages the Baron might send to his gunships. All right, team, we've got all night to prepare. If we take this thing, it'll mean more than a trophy. Penelope is sure to join our gang. After her stellar work defending our hangar, I'm sure we'd all agree that she's a prime recruit. There it is. We have some missions and a half, and they all start with Bentley, apparently. But, <laughs> here we are, guys. We have a lot of stuff to buy, yet again. Alright, let's get to it. And there it is guys, we have made it to our 5400 target. Holy crap. <laughs> Again. Such, such a big, such a big waste of time <laughs> to get all of it in one go. I don't know if I'm going to keep doing this for all these episodes, it just takes so long. It's like a full hour of my time spent straight pickpocketing. But now it's time to buy some stuff. Okay, I need 5,200. Damn it. Oh well. We now have amazing powers for all of these guys. Let's see what we have on our Bentley, shall we? Insanity Strike. Oh, Grapple Cam, yeah! Okay, that's already good. Magnet, I don't need to throw a bomb. I don't need a health extractor. I need Grapple Cam. Check out Gra Grapple Cam. I'm literally a camera. I can fly around. Look at this. How cool is this? What? <laughs> you can destroy stuff like that. We can go attack the wolf too. You can also say stuff by pressing the circle button. Do you reckon I can get up somewhere high? I'm trying to see if I can hit the blimp when it comes around. Come on. What if I get up on here? Come on. On the blimp. Hell yeah! Come over to this position. Follow the sound of my voice. <laughs> and then all you have to do... Uh, actually, I'm going to go over to the... Um, Oh my god, I can't. Come on, crab under the windmill! No, I'll go back up here. I can't go anywhere. I can go down to the ground, that's about it. Come on, where else can I grapple onto around here? On this thing. The underside of this. I can fly right through that. I can hit these guys from here. <laughs> Smoked him. Alright, where are we going? Let's go see our little friend, the wolf. That is such a long pull. Whoa! Okay. Well, he just destroyed us. 
But let's see what we should do first. Beauty and the Beast or Giant Wolf Massacre? I think we should do some Beauty and the Beast. I can fly. Hell yeah. It's time we dealt with Mugshot. We can't risk him taking down the Baron before you in the finals. Not to mention he deserves a little payback for what he did to our aircraft hangar. True, true. Since Mugshot's assault, the Baron has been keeping an eye on him. We can't fight him out in the open for risk of getting disqualified. Thankfully, Inspector Fox is out in the field looking for us. I hear you. We'll set them against each other. Mugshot is an international criminal, after all. Carmelita won't be able to resist. My only concern is for Inspector Fox's safety. Oh, don't worry about her. She's more than a match for a meathead like Mugshot. Okay, I'll pick a fight with Mugshot and bait him into meeting in the town square for our rumble. You do that. I'll get Carmelita's attention and lead her back here to the same place. Agreed. I've got to hand it to you, Benley. This is a really underhanded plan. Why, thank you. I'm feeling pretty good about it. What the heck was that framing on Sly? That was so weird. Can't go any faster. <laughs> he jumps so weird. I wonder where Mugshot is. <laughs> jumps sideways. Ah. Oh. I'll beat it, twerp. The Black Baron's been giving me the grill since that event in your hangar. Perhaps you'd like to take out some frustration by engaging in a physical battle with me outside in the town square. No way. I'm being watched here. That, and it wouldn't feel right pounding a four-eyed runt in a wheelchair. <laughs> All right. Got to bait him. Um, his breath, his mental facilities. Is that? No, that's faculties. Lol. Um, he's a record versus the Cooper Bank. Sure we'll go with that. Win in the fight anyway. You've got such a long, sad history of losing to the Cooper Gang. I could whip your whole gang with one arm if you jerk would sit still. Look at these arms. I'm unstoppable. <laughs> oh God. Um, his appearance. You know, I've been thinking about your appearance. Look. If you don't got nothing to say nice, then don't say nothing at all. Get it? What? Ain't got no sassy comment, smart guy? Oh, I get it. You got nothing nice to say, so you're keeping quiet. That's real cute. You really got nothing nice to say? That's cold. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Mental faculties. Do you even know what I'm saying to you? Or are you too stupid to understand the words coming in through your ear holes? What? What's an ear hole? Talk sense, why don't you? Oh my god. Uh, his brother is mother. Let's go for his mother. Your mother was a broken down tub of junk with more gentleman callers than the operator. Nobody talks that way about my mother. Nobody! Okay, little broken down runt. Looks like you're gonna get broken down even more. Town Square, five minutes. Please don't be late. Okay, Sly. Mugshot is on his way outside. Go find Inspector Fox and lead her back to the town square. Oh my. It's all the way over there. Wait, how am I going to lead her back by just getting chased? And what is Carmelita doing here? All of a sudden. Did you just get a hint that she's... That she's around us? Oh. More loot. Hell yeah. Definitely going to use that because... We are going to need it. Oh, look at that. Can you believe I only found one of those? Until then. We have silent obliteration. What else do we have? We have a disguise. We have shadow power. That's better. 
Paraglide, Combat Dodge, and uh, Venice Disguise. No, yep. Shadow Power. Check it out. Literally invisible. Watch this. What? Hey, Inspector Fox. Still looking for a date to the prom? Quit running and I'll spin the corsage on you. Oh my god. Where am I going over here? Bro! Dude! What? I now I've got no head. Oh, it's back. It's okay. And she is slow. I wonder I always get away. Mugshot, alias Two Gun Tony, also known as Meathead Mugshot. Seven foot three inches, 324 pounds, wanted in seven countries with 13 outstanding warrants for your arrest. And yes, I'm that cob hag that put you away back in Mesa. Well, wise guy, lady, feel like going for another shot at the title? It's my duty to put you behind bars. That. And I enjoy making tough guys cry like the stupid babies they really are. I ain't no stupid baby! God damn! It's Carmelita mission! Oh, that's right. I can... Oh, jump! Alright, so I can kick, jump, and make a jump. He's got his guns back. What did I get health for? Oh, this guy. <laughs> Alright. Um, yeah, her jaw was sort of missing again. Oh, you, you can shoot through that. Jump! Oh wow, that got me. Jeez, I wasn't even looking at my health. Legitimately not even looking at my health then. Oh my god. It's actually so difficult to control. And now I don't have a head. God damn it. <laughs> oh. That dynamite hurts a lot more. I'm sorry. I didn't know they was yours. Ugh, booking this idiot will take all night. Oh well, I'm sure Cooper won't make his move anytime soon. Uh, who was saying that? I didn't see a head on that person. <laughs> Alright. Guys, I'm sorry if this is a shorter episode, but this has been such a long episode to set up for me. So, I'm going to end it here. And we're going to head into Giant Wolf Massacre in the next episode. Thank you guys so much for watching this one. Have a lovely day. Goodbye. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this episode. Make sure you are subscribed and hit that like button if you want to see more. Thank you again. Bye.